Dear students, dear colleagues, dear staff members, dear guests of the Goethe University. The first week of this new physical winter semester at Goethe University has been mastered with success. You all played a decisive role in this. And as president of Goethe University, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Students and lecturers have confidently accepted the offer of presidency, which the executive board had promised you since early May. Certainly, after three digital semesters, still a little apprehensive at the beginning, in the future course of the last week, increasingly liberated. In the lecture halls and seminar rooms of the Goethe University, presence is once again the norm, and almost everyone is happy about it. Many thanks, and no less heartfelt, to all of those who have been planning this enormous fit of reopening for many months and are now putting it into practice. First and foremost to my executive board colleague, Ms. Thompson, and the colleagues of the crisis team. First and foremost, Mr. Humrich and Ms. Kerber, who have been working tireless for months, but also to our colleagues in real estate management, in the University Computer Center, in campus service, in student service, in the libraries, in the Bureau of Communication, in the Dean's offices, the lecturers, all of them, and all of those not mentioned here, they all have played a decisive role in making this first week a success. Now we have to carry this positive spirit for our students into the weeks ahead. If the Goethe community, that is all of us, has learned one thing in the corona crisis, it is we can implement and achieve more than we sometimes give ourselves credit for. Since our opening plans go far beyond what is currently possible at most of the other university locations in Hesse and Germany, we have also had to make various prioritizations for which I ask especially all externals for understanding in the interest of our students, teachers and staff. Study, teaching and research have absolute priority for the time being. We are constantly reviewing our rules in order to be able to react flexible to changes if necessary. To ensure a safe start to the semester and to keep the risk of infection from the still rampant pandemic to a minimum, we have had to draw some temporary boundaries. At first, external persons cannot enter good university buildings used for teaching and or research without a compiling reason. One exception is the university library in Bockenheim, which is still open to all under 3G conditions. It is for you and our safety reasons. Second, dear students, please continue to make such active use of our offer to have your 2G status printed on your personal Goethe card. For more than 10,000 fellow students, this means unproblematic access to all university buildings. And third, dear guests, I know that for many of you, the news was frustrating that no face-to-face -face study seems or seem possible in the new semester. However, in the last few days, we have done a lot to offer alternatives. As president of the Goethe University, however, I would ask you to respect the fact that in this extraordinary situation, which demands everything of us, we cannot create exceptional permits for various groups and persons. And I would ask you to respect the fact that Goethe University is first and foremost a place of research and teaching and that these are its core tasks. But we offer support as much as possible. One word to our international colleagues and students. If you miss information in English on our website or in the frequently asked questions section, 
please do not hesitate to inform our crisis team. Each comment improves our communication and your information. Thank you very much for your understanding and I hope that we all have a successful start to the semester in presence. Thank you.